Hey 8th graders, this is Mr. Lopez and I'm going to go ahead and uh, do a little quick tutorial and show you how to add the iBooks, the eBooks to the iBooks app on your iPad. So as you can see on the source list on the left hand side, I, have already ha I already have my iPad plugged in and these are the little tabs where you can go ahead and control what goes onto your iPad and what does not. So a lot of you know that the uh, music one, movies and TV shows and such, Books is what I'm going to focus on. Now I've already downloaded the ebooks from the Edmodo site and all of my downloads go in this folder. So yours might go onto a different one. If you're using Windows, it might go on the desktop. So just make sure that you know where your downloads go. And then all I have to go ahead and do is either click sync all books if you don't have a lot of books, or you can go ahead and look for them specifically. So um, these are not it. These are PDFs. This is the uh, Panda Express article that I put up on Edmodo. And all you have to do now is click on Apply here. Or if you'd like to go back to the Summary tab and click Apply, same deal. Now this is the part that might get a little tricky. iTunes is going to want to back up your iPad. And if you have a lot of apps, it's going to have to back up 14 gigabytes worth of music and different things, apps bookmarks, links, etc. You can actually stop the backup for now if it's taking too long, but I would recommend that you back up your iPad like we said about once a week or you know a couple of times a month. Here it's going to sync all the apps and things that are on my iPad that are not on my computer. If you get this error message, don't freak out. All it's saying is that you stop the backup and it's not a big deal, so just keep in mind that you should have regular backups. Here my iPad is complete, it's synced, and I can double check the books by going onto the iTunes source list here. Here are all the ebooks that I have on my iPad, or if you'd like, you can go ahead and click on the books tab and double check that the books that I need for my class are checked off here. Thanks a lot. If you have any more questions, feel free to put up any questions on Edmodo. Have a good weekend.